Hey everyone, and welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix Peacock not working on your Samsung Smart TV. Now this video is gonna be particularly useful for individuals who are trying to fix their Peacock application. Maybe it's not opening, or maybe it's not streaming movies or TV series. How do you actually go ahead and fix it? Now I'm gonna be going over a variety of different solutions that you can try out guys, starting with the first one where it's to unplug and replug your Samsung Smart TV. Now you'll be surprised at what wonders unplugging and replugging your TV does, but once you unplug your Samsung Smart TV, you want to leave it unplugged for about a minute and then replug it back in and then see if your Peacock application now works. Now, if that doesn't work, the next thing that you can do is that you can delete your Peacock application and then reinstall it. Now, the way that I do this is that on my Samsung Smart TV, if I go into this app section here, and then from here, I want to go into the settings tab. So settings is on the upper right hand side here. Your settings might look different from mine because we have different TV models. But from here, I'm simply just looking for the Peacock application, okay? So here's Peacock, and then I'm just gonna click on delete. And then once I delete this application, I'm going to reinstall it and then see if that works. So try that out, guys. And so right now we've covered three different solutions to try to get your so right now we've covered two different solutions to try to get your Peacock application to work. But if it's still not working, the next thing that you can do is you can factory reset your TV. So the way to do that is that if you click on the home button and then next you're gonna click on the settings button. And then from here, you wanna scroll down to where it says the general tab. And then from here, you wanna go ahead and click on the reset button. So this reset button is going to restore all your Samsung Smart TV settings to its original factory defaults. So try this out and see if it works for you in getting your Peacock application to work on your TV. The other thing that you can do, and this seldom works, but it's still worth a try, is that under support, you could actually go ahead and update the software of your TV and see if that gets your Peacock to now work. But right now guys, I've covered four different solutions to see to try and get your Peacock application to work. The other thing that you can do is that if your Peacock application is working but it's not streaming anything, you can simply do a sign in and sign out. So the way to do that is that on your Peacock TV, on your Peacock TV, on the left hand side, if you scroll all the way down, on the left hand side, if you click on your profile icon name, and then from here you wanna click on account on the upper right hand side, and then from here, and then from here, you want to go ahead and click out sign out, which is this button right over here. So by signing out and signing in, that might get your Peacock to now play videos on your Samsung Smart TV. But that essentially is the best and easiest way that I know of to actually go ahead and fix your Peacock TV not working on your Samsung Smart TV. But if you guys know of a better or easier way to actually do this, let me know in the comments down below. I would love to know. Thanks so much for watching everyone and I'll see you guys all in the next video.